Martini from Mini Bowl Design, and today I want to talk about my new Bongo Pro. So let me move the camera in and we'll take a look at this. Okay, I'm going to try to stand behind the camera and do this so I can see uh, what the camera sees while I'm doing it. Probably won't be the most graceful way, but anyway, let's go for it. Okay, I'm going to pull the hose off this. Uh, this is uh, the Bongo Pro 2. Now what I basically did was I took a regular bongo base or I took the regular bongo base idea and made a new one and this time instead of putting the slot in the middle I just made one ring the basically the same thickness as the two rings on the other one I put the uh, nine holes in actually eight holes and where the ninth hole goes I milled it out and put in a uh, bottom feed so now this will work with the chicken water and then on top of that, I uh, put a turbo top on it, but not a regular turbo top, a turbo top like is on the uh, gerbil cage. Now there's no nipple on this because it's bottom feed, and I've included a simmer ring along with it. So basically what we have is a Bongo Pro with the regular legs and that's bottom feed it weighs two ounces and it has a simmer ring uh... comes with uh... three extra legs of course and if, if you have anything for a uh... remote feed this will work fine with it and of course it works with the beer can parts too the index is perfect for those so here i'll set there super lightweight only weighs two ounces and I'm going to offer this at a really good price, so get them while they're hot, guys. I don't know how long they're going to last. I'm Tinny from Mini Bowl Design. Get out and hike, take a friend, enjoy the great outdoors, and more important than anything, have a really great day. Bye-bye.